The government will put resources in the budget to support the various implementation programs that will be agreed upon. We are hence also asking the county governments, the five county governments, Nairobi, Kiambu, Kajiano, Machakos, and Makueni, to consider appropriating monies through their county assemblies to support this program. Even as we look for money from the donor community, even as we try to harness resources from our friends, we must lead by example. And the national government has already started by putting in resources. And we are hence also requesting the county governments to also uh, allocate monies for the programs that will be carried out under this commission. We did agree that uh, we must get moving and activities must begin in earnest. The state of the Nairobi rivers is deplorable. It's indeed embarrassing. And uh, it's not only a health hazard, but environmentally, it is a big shame to our country. The president has hence come in to help me to unlock all the issues that could be delaying the implementation of the restoration of these rivers. This meeting has been convened. Father has directive, but uh, by His Excellency the President, Dr. Mian yesterday, on the Narod Rivers Commission, and the urgent need to get things moving and to have participation of all stakeholders. So we have agreed that uh, there is a provision in the regulations for co-opting members. We are going to co-opt members from the counties of Machakos, Makueni, Kajiado and Kiambu. And the four governors are requested to submit to the chairperson their nominees who will represent them on a day-to-day -day basis as part of the commission because the decisions that will be made by the Commission, the implementation, and all no issues surrounding Nairobi Rivers Commission has a direct impact on the great people of Kiambu, Kachiado, Machakos, and Makweni. We have agreed that the President will take the lead to assist me to give the Commission the gravitas that is required that comes with that high office so that we can be able to harness resources and we can be able to pull technical personnel from across government, from our development partners, from our friends, to come and help us in this great and difficult journey of restoring the rivers.